All right, people, what's up, everyone, and welcome to another reaction video for today. And this time, I'm taking a look at the Season 1 cinematic for Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War, uh, which I have played. Uh, I didn't play Modern Warfare from last year, so I didn't watch any of the season stuff for that. But I am playing Black Ops Cold War. I finished the campaign a few days ago. Really, really good. I still need to do some of the side stuff. But a uh, great campaign. I actually really liked it. Um, I, I do give a lot of props to the ps5 on that front because the ray tracing is mm, oh it's so good um the game itself obviously the creator Treyarch, and everybody else that worked on it obviously created the graphics but just because it was on ps5 it looks so gorgeous and those freaking the impulse triggers and the haptic feedback yo when you get that shotgun shotgun feels good man it really does um so it was really fun uh it was short too a lot of games nowadays are like 30 hours long Th that game i finished in like five hours i was like perfect perfect length um anyway call of duty black ops cold war this is season one i don't know what's gonna show um if it's gonna be anything like from the zombies stuff or if it's just gonna be multiplayer stuff i know the Warzone ps5 remaster or whatever comes out I think the 10th, so I wonder if it's going to show that in some form. I don't know. So I'm going into this pretty blind still, even though I play the game. Uh, I don't know a lot of the lore behind everything else. I know Zombies has like a huge cutscene that plays right before you can play Zombies, which is insane. Like, I watched a little bit of it, and I was like, whoa, all right, cool. Anyway, let's, uh, let's uh, go. <laughs> okay. I'm scared. Nadler has some pieces of the puzzle. Hadler. Oh, is this supposed to be? No, okay. he's a piece himself. He won't live long enough to work that out. I won't show him mercy. He showed me. I was in charge of the production of Nova 6 on Rebirth Island. I answered to Colonel Kravchenko himself. Kravchenko. I was loyal. My star ascended. Until the Americans found us. That's when I met Russell Adler. Adler's a badass. Freak me. I tell your boss, this is for Weaver. Oh. For letting Rebirth fall, Kravchenko sent me to Gulag. Where I found my true calling. Did you win and get to go back in Orza? Oh. He's trying to bait you, Adler. No shit. <laughs> stop him, civilians are gonna die. I love Adler. I think Adler's a really cool character. a little bit different in this uh this uh cinematic though kill the rest Adler is mine so is that gonna be like story stuff like I'm I'm a little confused on what is it gonna be exactly is it actually gonna be like new missions alright let's find out let's find out uh, a trap has been set, a CIA safe house has been hit, and an old enemy returns to get his revenge after storming an experimental Nova 6 production site on Rebirth Island. Russell Adler has made a powerful enemy in v Vicor? 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 Stitch, I'll just call him Lilo and Stitch. The ex CKGB member, I mean, leader of the Nova 6 program, and Stitch is looking to settle the score. Now, Adler and the CIA uh, strike team find themselves trapped and surrounded by enough Nova 6 nerve gas to throw the world off its axis. Season 1 arrives. Okay, so it's just going to be more like. But, alright, because I never played Modern Warfare, so I'm, I'm confused on how the seasons work in there. Is there, like, story? Like, do you play, like, is there, like, a new mode or something? Like, I'm a little, I'm confused. Not a little, I'm very confused. How does that work? Should I go to the store? Maybe I'll explain. Let's go to the store. That's it. Let's go shopping. <laughs> Let's go shopping, guys. Alright. Um, Ultimate Edition, it's not gonna, I don't even know why I did this. It's cool you get a bunch of free stuff, because I think the maps are going to be free too, right? Here's the cross-gen button. Okay, it's not going to tell me. Um, 
please let me know. I actually really want to know. Here, maybe the comments will talk about it because uh, I'm interested. These guys have to focus more on gameplay than the cinematic. Yeah, the cinematic wasn't. It was weird because Russell looks so different, right? Uh, free content update. Let me refer. Is that for you? Here's the content you paid for a month ago. That's better. Uh, because are, are they suggesting they took the content out of the? I but that story. The story here seems like it wouldn't fit exactly in. Uh, well, I guess it could, because they could just say like this is a side mission or something, right? I'm sure it will end up being that, you know. Like, hey, let's go do this, you know? Uh, but I don't know. Remember when games came out with full... Co- oh, is this really supposed to be stuff that was supposed to be... Huh, so is it, so this is the launch trailer? Should have been launched with the game. Wow. <laughs> Ripped everyone that cracked the code. Oh, I didn't do that yet. Is this actually... I didn't do that, so I still that's one of the side. I only well, there's only two side missions. I didn't do either of the side missions. Actually, thinking about it, I think there's only two. I think one I tried to do, or no, I was collecting evidence, but then I missed a couple of things. Of evidence, and I was like, you know, I have all these other games to play. I'll, I'll come back to this. So see you in here. I'm so confused. I really am. It's cool how the mall is back to the future. I, I guess. Uh, I'm kind of nervous about playing this game. It looks like the one from Back to the Future, actually. So I think you did. Well, it's not coming out until next week anyway, so. Those guys in the intro are in a reverse boosted lobby, okay? Literally the only thing that's keeping me interested in this game is zombies. Okay, someone tell Adler to put his glasses on. Yeah, he doesn't look as cool without his glasses, right? Uh, <laughs> he just doesn't look, he looks weird in this this trailer, though, I'm assuming. Y'all need, need to fix that SBMM, please. What is that? SBMM. Hey, I'm, I guess I'm a noob when it comes to, what is SBMM? Let's see. Getting such easy lot. What? I'm so confused. What the hell? He's had enough. All right. What's SBMM? Am I just stupid? I, I think I'm stupid. I, I'm having a good time with Call of Duty Cold War. I don't know. Uh, oh, skill based matchmaking. Okay. 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 I've never seen it like um, described as SBMM before, but I guess I don't play too many skill based multiplayer games. Um, so I, I'm assuming that means like if I'm really good, I'll be facing off against people that suck sometimes, I guess. Saying these guys have to focus more on gameplay than the cinematic law. Free content update. Let me rephrase that for you. Here's the content. Yeah, I'm still. Co- All right. So there's, there's a lot, of, there's a lot. It seems like there's a lot of hate with Cold War. Um, it's weird because I really like the campaign and I, I've been having a good time with multiplayer. I don't think I've, I've felt like I've ever been really matched up with teams that are way better than me. Um, I feel like it's been either fair or I've done well enough where I don't feel like, you know, I've done, I've done good enough. I, I think pretty much every game I've went either neutral or positive. Um, if I went negative, then it wasn't like too far. And, I, and that might've been like beginning of when I was playing too. Um, I do need to play more though. I, when it comes to multiplayer, I play maybe like seven, eight hours, which is nowhere near as much as some people, but a good amount to be able to share my opinion. Though. All right. Well, anyway, there you go. That's, it's weird. I I have so many questions. Please let me know. I'm sure people are giving me shit just for not knowing anything. But I like to go into these trailers kind of blind. So, and that's the one problem about doing that is that you have no idea what the fuck is happening. <laughs> so, anyway, there you go. That's it. Hope you enjoyed it. Thank you. Until next time, I'll see you guys later. Goodbye.